Nochdeer in 2004. Stephen Hirsch it's a clear case for the State Commission on Judicial Conduct a convicted fraudster steering people facing debt collection cases to lawyers who somehow managed to appear before Judge Nochdeer, regularly winning sweet rulings from a judge elected with the fraudster's help. Mind you, Tier was elected to the state's Supreme Court bench in 2015, but manages to help out in civil court most Mondays and Tuesdays. This, when the state's chief judge kicked him off the criminal court bench years ago for bizarre rulings there. As Melissa Klein reported in Sunday's Post, the ex can is Heim Pinkes, who pled guilty in 1986 to trafficking in phony Cartier watches and other counterfeits, serving four months in federal prison. Now he's a fixer in Brooklyn helping mostly Orthodox Jews link up with lawyers who then manage to get the case heard by Deer. And he's a fixture in Deer's courtroom, where the judge regularly dismisses consumer debt cases or forces settlements that greatly favor the debtor. At least one Jewish leader says Pinkes actively campaigned to help Deer nab his Supreme Court spot in a deal among county Democratic Party factions. Yet this hack shouldn't be on any bench there's no sign he ever practiced law, he was dogged by scandals as a city councilman and as a taxi limousine commission member and first won a civil court seat in a backroom bargain with the late, notoriously corrupt county leader Vito Lopez despite a thumbs down from the Brooklyn Bar Association. Once it receives a formal complaint, the Commission on Judicial Conduct has the power to investigate judges for unethical behavior and impose a range of punishments. It has removed 169 jurists since 1975 here's hoping it reaches 170 soon.